Hello there folks, this is Tyler Lessman, core developer with Spectora, here to show you how to export your Whisper template for import into Spectora. First thing you want to do after opening Whisper is go up to File and go Browse Reports. The first thing we're going to do is open our template to be imported. The first thing we'll want to do is check this box up here that says Mark as Template. That way we only have templates, not reports. Then we'll select the template we'd like to import, which I'll go ahead and select this boilerplate one for today. It is now open. Now at this point, we're gonna go up to File. We're gonna go up to Data Manager. We're gonna going to select Backup Reports and or other data to a backup file and select Next. Then we're gonna select Backup Current Report Only. Then we're gonna hit Next. At this point, it's going to ask us where we'd like to place our backup file. It's going to go into my, my documents at the moment, so we'll go ahead and hit Next. And then at this screen, we're going to hit Backup. After that completes, we'll go ahead and hit OK, and then we'll hit Close. We're not done just yet. That's the main template information, but there's something else we'd like to get. Let's go ahead and go up to File, then go to Data Manager. Again, we're going to select Backup Reports or Other Data to a Backup File, and then we're going to select Next. At this point, we're going to click on Rapid Remarks. These are important. Let's go ahead and hit Next. At this point, you can just select all. Go ahead and hit Next. Then again, it's going to ask us for where we'd like to place the backup. Again, this will go into My Documents. Then we're going to select Backup. Now at this point, we don't need Whisper any longer. So let's go ahead and close that and minimize Whisper. Now I have two windows open here, which are both in my documents, as you see up here at the top. We have our main template, and we have our rapid remarks backup. Let's go ahead and open up our rapid remarks backup. In here, you should see three files which are marked exactly like this. We're going to go ahead, select all three, and drag them to the same folder that contains our backups. At this point, we do not need two windows. In fact, we didn't need them earlier, but it does make this process easier to demonstrate. Now we're going to select these, all three again, and we're going to drag them on top of our main template. What this does is it inserts these files into our existing template export. So at this point, you should have a bunch of files up here that are filled with alphabet soup. That's all right. This alphabet soup is their report ID or the template ID. And each one of these represents like common information, document structure, folder structure, stuff that's not important to you, but it's important to us. And then we have our rapid remark stuff. If you have all of these and all of these, you're good to go. And you're ready to import your Whisper template into Spectora. Thanks for watching, and I hope that you enjoy using Spectora.